Alright guys, what's up? Today we're just talking some okay. Today we're gonna kill Olivana Morcano. My god. Let's go kill her. And then after that, it's Sal Morcano. Holy cow. I don't know if after this, after we finish the mission, will be side missions. I think so, there's gonna be. And now I'm gonna see if we respond to some side missions. Because I really want to finish the game 100%. You know? So, yeah. And this car is actually not bad. Alright, so we're gonna. So, last mission we killed her, her, her husband. Wait, this is. I feel this is where we met. Sal Marcano. This is this is the day we we met him and then he told us to take after the, his old man. But Olivia's look at the country club. Get in. I'll run you through the plan. The plan. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Marcano's having real estate problems. Does that? I still don't understand why Olivia Marcano was involved in any of this. By all accounts, she had two or three times the money that Sal Marcano had. Money didn't mean shit to her. From what I was able to piece together, she hired someone to kill Lucho. Wanted to run things herself. Bottom line, I think she got off on all that mob bullshit. We're fucked, Olivia. You understand? That fucking shit stain Duval didn't name us in the will. Now everything's going to his goddamn nephew. Have you actually reviewed the will? I read the part that said all the land I'm building my casino on is now going to Stephen motherfucker DeGamo. I read that part. Six months ago, Remy revised the will, but he never executed it. What the hell are you talking about? In order for the will to be valid, it needs to be signed. Well, goddammit, woman, I know that. What does it mean for us? It means I have grounds to contest. Remy and I were business partners in several ventures, and one of my holding companies lists the land as an ancillary asset. Sounds like a lawyer's wet dream. What's something like that gonna run me? I haven't the slightest idea. Nearly every cent I got is tied up in that goddamn casino. I can't afford a big legal fight. There's got to be another way out of this mess. Steven is coming to town for the funeral. I could arrange a meeting. Offer him a percentage of the casino's profits if he signs over the land. Yeah. Yeah, that could work. And then once he signs, we take care of him. All right, set it up. My patience is at its goddamn end, do you understand, Olivia? I'm tired of this bullshit. Have a little faith, Sal. Now, uh, Mr. Clay entered the country club disguised as a waiter. What? Everyone in attendance was a rich asshole or part of the Southern Union, so getting Lincoln in there was easy. You put a black man in a uniform and he's damn near invisible. Hell, I drove in through the front gate and dropped him off. No one even gave us a second look. No. Surely, his uniform wasn't enough to get him past Mrs. McConnell's personal security detail. I mixed up a vial of fast-acting LSD. You know, same basic formula that we use as part of MK Ultra, and I gave it to Lincoln. He used a syringe to put a couple of drops into every drink he served. <laughs> Within a couple of minutes, anyone who drank that concoction was whacked out of their goddamn mind. Fuck me. What? What happened? I never learned how to tie a bow tie. <laughs> you sure you're up for this? Shit, I'll get in there and dose the guards with his military grade LSD and get to Olivia. And Don't then let those her. pricks goad you into anything. Remember, you won't be able to take any weapons with you. Oh. How's it going, buddy? Follow the driveway up to the left. Bro, I, I kind of wonder, will we kill his son? I think his name is what, George? Because that guy who shot Lincoln, his own friend, I think he believed him. It looked like it, he showed us that it's his friend. You've got the case, the syringe is in there. And remember, the drug acts fast. It'll fuck up whoever gets a dose real quick. Good. No sense of giving anyone time to figure out what's happening. Let me get a look at you. Mm. If they kill you, at least they'll have something nice to bury you in. <laughs> yeah, I guess so.
All right. You see, everybody else got here on time. Them crackers put their hands all over everybody else. Lazy nigga. That's their job. Had me out there. Fucking asked me where I got my car. Where I'm from. You best get in that uniform or get out of my goddamn kitchen, Claudia. Follow me. All right. Sounds good. Cool. On that counter, looking like a goddamn rat's nest. Miss Olivia's gonna be out soon. She gonna say some words for old Mr. Remy. Can't stand a lazy nigga. Nothing low on the face of God's earth. Mm -hmm, interesting. Get one of those out there to them folks and serve them their drinks. And don't go talking to any of them, you hear? Get them folks their drinks now. All right. Are we gonna put the drugs? Here we are. Look around. Nobody is here. Is that oh, all of them? Oh, you see the so it's like these like kind of sp like, like SpongeBob these. I think so. This is like the one, not the metal la lid. The ones that you, it's like it's like. Did we? Okay, serve the manager. Nah, stop right there. Hold on. You ain't been paid to stand around, boy. Go serve no. them poor folks. Drink oh. up, motherfuckers. All right. So, do they have a suspect? Now the one. Old All right. No way we're gonna serve them. Rattle some of them monkeys' cages. Just sit. See it being one of the coloreds. Fucking apes was never too smart, but you know. Let me walk around. See who who needs. I have to. You guys wanted some alcohol? Get her. See. I'd like to personally thank y'all for coming to see our dear friend Remy Duvall off. I know with all of the violence that has reached its way into our community, it might have felt safer just to stay at home or even leave town. But you did what Remy would have done. You held your head high and you didn't run away. It's not exaggerating to say that Remy was a brave man. But his bravery is not what I'll miss most about him. All right. What I'll miss most about Remy Duval is that he gave this city. No, he gave us a voice. The man who murdered Remy robbed this city of someone who honored its history. Not only that. Remy respected our shared Christian heritage, which extends all the way back to Europe. Hmm. Remy was a dear, dear friend of mine. A dear friend to all of us. No. In the coming days and weeks, let's honor his memory by taking back our city. By preserving the way of life we hold dear. To Remy. To Remy. No, not to Remy. Oh, with those beards and that long hair. Oh, they just look so filthy to me. My dear. Okay. Alright, we need to serve we them. Find this shine who killed Remy. He's gonna wish he was dead. Nice Rachel, pants, asshole. Please keep your voice down. What? Get oh, over here with he's that bottle man. One of the good ones. There you go. All right. Sure. You look parched. Have some wine. This guy who died. Oh, so this is a funeral. Okay. This is doesn't look like a funeral. Well, probably. I don't know. Maybe it's just 
Normal like like South American. You know? South or North Africa was I think we're North. Alright. I'll buy her flowers, maybe something shiny, and it'll all blow over. And if it doesn't turn her around, well, well, I guess there are always more fish in the sea. Yep. Alright. Hey, I've never bring actually that seen the nephew here. either. I had her some money. Just give it time. Maybe. My condolences. Spill it. What do you know? Yes. Well, I'll miss him too. Take to smoke there was break. A lot more to the Duval fortune when his daddy died. Hey, let them burn their brawls. Just makes it easier to see what they're working with. Sure thing. Alright, let's just go and take a smoke break and then they're all gonna die. Thank you. Yes, he was a good man. Alright. I thought it's gonna act fast, but... It doesn't look like they're gonna act fast. How he's like in is he hallucinating? Big old man dingo nigga. I feel like he's just going crazy. Man, I run fast. I mean he just walk out. I don't like walking. You know, usually like everybody don't like to to wait. Well, let's see. Okay, here. Let's see the think these people are thing with us, maybe. Because we can. Hey, new guy, you can smoke over here. All right. You see how Clarence is behaving? Looks like he's got a touch of whatever's going around out there. <laughs> Ask me, it couldn't have happened to a nicer fella. Serves him right. Nigga this, nigga that. It's every other word that comes out of his mouth. Bad enough hearing it from all these white folks. Don't need to get it from one of our own. Maybe after this, he'll rethink how he runs things around here. That'll be the damn day. Hmm. So he's smoking. Yeah. Take smoke break. Pull out all of them. Oh. The moon, Never mind. Cause all gonna be white. Okay, we have to follow now. Mm -hmm. Oliver is not here. Yet. She might be waiting for me. But though, super fun, she said the guy I who killed. Going out there. Something's gotten into those folks. Something bad. I don't care what Clarence says, I'm staying in here. Those people have gone crazy. Been to cut that crap. What was what I you... saying now? I just... <laughs> I wish what the I could hell? Show you. <laughs> it's all connected. <laughs> you see? We, you, <laughs> me, him. Do you yeah. see We're light trails? You're right, they're going crazy. <laughs> Get me out of here now. Yes, ma'am. I want additional men placed on the front door and around back. No one's allowed in or out without my say so. Never mind. Such as you saw them, they've all come down with some kind of affliction. They should have known that I dropped him. What is he doing? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Hostile. Okay. That for Ms. Marcano? Yeah. I mean, yes, sir. Go on through. Put it on the ball. Put it down. Put it on the ball. Has the uh, signed yet? No, ma'am. And they've been beating on them pretty hard. 
Take one of his hands. See if that changes his mind. All right. Away from here before How the hell am I gonna kill them? Oh, there's a weapon. I think our Negro friend here is a little dim. Alright. Stick a steel. Shoot him. Hey, I see you. Okay. We need to confront her now. It's time. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Oh shit. Miss Olivia, you in there? The hell is happening? Ah! All right, never mind. I got a trophy. Okay, open it. So far, not too bad. Dude. Oh shit, he's there. I'm not gonna go touch, shoot our people. I will just try to shoot the necessary. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Now, I ain't asking you a second time, boy. You the sign over that land? Hmm? I swear to Christ. I will bust every fucking bone in your body. You hear me? Hmm? I'm not, I'm not signing a damn thing. <laughs> Shit. This guy is getting tortured. Well, not on my watch. No, not on my watch. I don't tolerate that language here at home. Say good night to the ass. We got ourselves. Okay. Big bitch. Cock 
cocksucker. I got that cocksucker. <laughs> Sharp, huh? <laughs> Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's get this motherfucker. Look who our friend. Little motherfuckers die first. Cover my ass. What the hell? Okay. you out of here but we need to move Marcano's probably sending more men yeah okay if they brought me here in my own car I think it's still near all right yeah. escape this is okay. this guy get in Christ my hand is ruined I barely even knew Remy don't think about that Ah, uh, come on. Well, he know. One of these cops can help. You hire something. No, but are oh, and that day they knew what this. They used to use it. That word. Never knew they used to use that word. No, they. Alright. Holy cow! We got a swat. All right, we just have to drive now. They're gonna kill us before they do. We're gonna die right here on this road. Yep, we are. Holy cow! You hire something. You're gonna kill us before they do. We're gonna die right here on this road. Oh, responding units. This is the best. contact with suspect lost. All right, we just have to lose them now. Let me just call a car. Show sure you some wheels over here. I'm fucking blattered. Couldn't drive it. My life depended on it. Try me later. Okay. All right, let us. Come on. Let me see. Yeah, I see the road is gone. Hmm. Oh, How long okay. you think you'll last out there? Marcano ain't gonna rest till he finds you. He broke my hand! Shit! I just wanna go home. I know. Yeah. Listen, I got a friend. I knew for a while right. I'll keep you safe. At least till things calm down. Okay, thank you. You saved my life. Don't mention it. Yeah, don't. 
Don't just don't. It's an unsolved for us. Appreciate it. All right. All right. Let's just drive there and and then take him to a uh, some to the van something and then I think this is the end of getting Ivana. But oh, actually we didn't. Actually, we lost. We got the cops on our. I think we can bribe them. I thought we can bribe them. But I guess we can't. Alright, let's just keep going. We're almost there. We're almost there guys, so let's just keep driving. Let's keep driving, keep driving. Man, this is like very kinda of long very inten in in deep inten intense mission. I think we're gonna take him are we gonna gonna take him to Father James I think his name? Or are we gonna take him to Devon something? Okay, that's it. What happened to Steven DeGarmo? Lincoln left him with me and I got him the hell out of there. And you still know DeGarmo's whereabouts? Like I tell any of you assholes. Where, where is she gonna take us? Good morning, Ms. Marcano. I'm here with your breakfast. Let's freshen this room up. Get some of that sunlight in here. That's better. Are you telling me Lincoln Clay did not murder Olivia Marcano? He didn't kill women unless he had no other choice. I find that very hard to believe. <laughs> Back in 67, we were in a bar in Saigon. And this gook bitch comes strolling in, skirt barely covering her ass, and she starts offering everybody blowjobs. G.I. wants sucky fucky. Hmm? G.I. wants boom boom. Then she pulls out a grenade and she kills three guys. A couple Marines in the bar want to cut that bitch's head off, but Lincoln stops them. Keeps them off her until the MPs show up. If he wasn't going to kill that slag, he sure as fuck wasn't going to kill Olivia Marcano. Lincoln once told me he couldn't tell any other cheek. That the world doesn't work that way. <laughs> I spent the better part of 40 years trying to prove him wrong. But I was just lying to myself. Look at how we treat each other. Compassion is a sign of weakness. But greed is a virtue. The poor is considered morally corrupt, while every excess of the powerful is celebrated. We sent kids off to die. For what? So someone can make a few bucks? Lincoln was right. He was always right. <laughs> there ain't never gonna be another Dr. King or Bobby Kennedy. But there always gonna be another Sal Marcano, another Sammy Robinson. That's true. Another Lincoln Clay. We are cruel and wicked people. Oh, that's, uh, that's inspiring. That was them inspiring, in my opinion. Tell me about you guys' opinion about this this mission. I mean, it's intense. I heard something in the background. Okay, I see now what's gonna happen. So now we have to keep, keep somebody. Do you think? Yes, this is where we find which direction you and I are headed. 
This is your final chance to make things right between us, brother. I gave you already. Secure in a future where we're working together to help our people. And it starts with you giving me this territory. The city's now under our control. And Cassandra, I know our partnership has been in a bit of free fall lately. But I'm hopeful we can work this out. Still, I need to hear from everyone. You gotta decide how important she is. Where she fits in the future of what we're doing. If she don't, cut her the fuck loose. Jesus, lad. Just give her the district and let's get on with our goddamn lives. You do uh. right by me, or you'll be seeing Richard do... Cassandra wants to walk. Let her. Off our fuck's sake. Yeah, you I want to go. I'm gonna go you'll for her. Right here, Lincoln, or there will... You got no idea how long I've been... We've come this far together, Lincoln. Oh, they're showing us well. They're gonna away. give him... Concerns me that you even consider in someone else. Let's okay, that's interesting. I will get this one. Or this. Concerns me that you gotta say this action's perfect for Cassandra. We got a lot to work with here, brother. This is real good. <laughs> I, I have Wade Fagan Lincoln will have killed us all by now. What we done here? Taking the city away from Marcana and doing it without killing each other? We gotta be proud of that. Not everything went the way I would have liked it to go. But I'm proud of what I have and what we starting here. Holy Christ! How the fuck did we make it through this shite in one piece? I thought for a certain Scarlet I'd have his throat slit by now. It may not have all played out the way I would have liked. But we're here and we're making money. And Lord knows I'm a hell of a lot better at being alive than I am at being dead. I kind of thought I'd be gay to shit by now. So anything shy of that, and I'm good. I'd prefer to be running more rackets. And by more, I mean all of them, but fuck it. I'll just wait for one of you motherfuckers to bite it. <laughs> We're living proof that the ways of Marcano, the lying, the backstabbing, the cheating, don't need to run in that direction. Those ways are as dead as he is. Well, now after this, it's Sam Marcano. Forgot about that. No, actually, I didn't. Kill some Marcano now. Okay, thanks so much for watching. Scrum, scrum, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.